Hello, I am Dr. Nikila Sharma, practicing pediatrician. I have just recovered from a condition, medical condition called trigeminal neuralgia. This is a very painful condition. So such an excruciating electric pain and I was affected by it on the left side of my face, the cheeks and my jaw and it was intolerable. I consulted the neurologist and uh, the neurologist had prescribed some medications. The pain was so severe, for a few months I could not eat, I had sleepless nights and I was not able to practice or go to my clinic and hospital work. The medications given by the neurologists relieved me to a certain extent, but they were only temporary. So much so, after some time, they had to keep increasing the medications, the dosage of the medication and add on more tablets, wherein I had to take three to four tablets a day, three times a day. And these tablets are only making me sleepy and drowsy and the pain was not relieved at all. While I was exploring, I really wanted to get remedy from the pain. While I was exploring more options, so many options were given like uh, acupuncture for pain, homeopathy, Ayurvedic oil massage and uh, of course uh, other uh, alternate medicines and I tried each one of them and none of them relieved me of my pain and day in and day out it was getting worse. When it became so intolerable, then there was given an option of giving injection of alcohol into the nerve where it will numb the nerve and I will not have the pain. But all these medications have limitations and restrictions and they are only temporary. So this condition of trigeminal neuralgia where the artery and the nerve are rubbing against each other constantly close to the brain. So there was an option of surgery. I was suggested but none of the physicians gave me the confidence that I will recover completely, I will get rid of the pain after the surgery. So I was also hesitating for a pain in the tongue to have a brain surgery. I was postponing it and I didn't go for it. And my family also were very worried and you know very scared about the brain surgery. And at the same time, I knew that uh, it was just providential that I met Dr. Tristridhar in a holiday in a trip to Morocco and it was an extremely satisfying trip and I had a consultation after my family pressured me I went to him very in detail and very patiently he explained not only to me to my husband and my daughter what exactly was happening and how the surgery will relieve the pain he will remove the nerve and the artery from impinging and interpose something so that it will not get rubbed it gave me tremendous confidence and that is the only reason why I agreed for the surgery. The patience with which Dr. Sridhar explained was amazing. I didn't have an option but to agree for the surgery. I had the surgery about a month back. Yeah. The surgery which was suggested by Dr. Sridhar was called the microvascular decompression. So when he explained the entire procedure, I was very convinced and we agreed for the surgery immediately and I'm really very, very, very thankful to him. Not only the pain is relieved, but not having to take the tablets which were making me sleepy and groggy, all those painkillers and getting me back to the normal cheerful life is a big relief. And by God's grace, I'm totally and thanks to Sridhar and his team, I'm totally pain free. I was back to my work, I was back to eating and having comfortable sleep and a cheerful life. This confidence which Dr. Sridhar gave, I never got from any other doctor. I am really thankful to him for giving me this new agony-free, fresh lease of life. Thank you so much.